My husband and I moved here about seven years ago because we wanted to build our businesses in a place that was a gateway to Asia. And Singapore is definitely that. For anyone who wants to partake in the growing economy of the emerging middle class in Asia uh, with rapid urbanization, this is the place to be. And I'm really lucky that I'm here. And of course, I was here today because I was a speaker at GCCA and met a lot of interesting people. So thanks for having me. The main themes of my presentation today were how deep technologies like artificial intelligence, robotics, and virtual reality can optimize the built environment the way it's constructed and can help manufacturers, urban designers, and even citizens build around in a way that is sustainable, optimal, and efficient. The future of cities is relevant to all of us. Because more than ever before, millions of people are moving to cities and most of the world's population lives in urban environments. Why do they move to cities? For better healthcare, infrastructure, education. And unless we address these issues through the built environment by creating new, better, sustainable infrastructure, we won't be able to provide the kind of future that these and their future generations want. So more than ever before, with cities attracting the best talent, we need to provide an environment that is conducive to economic growth and quality of life. The role of the cement and concrete sector is very important in the future of cities. This is because more and more construction is taking place to accommodate the millions of people who are migrating to cities from China to India to Latin America, and even in Europe as they're moving from villages and pouring into cities that have become the hubs of capital and talent and economic growth. But if we don't build properly in a sustainable, efficient, and optimal manner, then instead of building things that are beneficial to society, we may end up with more costs and ineffective infrastructure.